Hello, fellow engineers, and welcome back to Sea of Survivors. Now, there's been a little update to this, which means there's a brand new weapon. Ooh. Oh, and also, I got 69 quid. Nice. nice. Right, so we start off in the sea. We've got our little sail ship. You'll notice, though, there's some boats about. They contain pirates who are trying to sabotage us and steal our ship from us. They're fed up of rowing. They want the power of wind speed to try and help them. Uh, but we will not let that happen. Anyway, you can see my new weapon. We've got like the ninja death star thing. This doesn't shoot planet destroying lasers, unfortunately. What the hell is an aluminum falcon? Um, it does seem to shoot two of them and they come out. Do they come out the front of my ship sort of like 45 degrees? Yeah, so it's quite hard. Oh, unless you do that to try and get some some good hits on enemies. Now, remember, if they touch me, it, it does damage. I've got 700 health in the top left. Um, every every kill we get, we get some XP. We don't need to pick up these coins. These just allow us to upgrade like next time. Uh, because we leveled up, we get a treasure chest. So when we open that, we get to pick between three different upgrades. So that one's coins at the end of run. I don't care about that. We can increase our projectile speed and range or increase our critical hit damage. What's our damage currently? Oh, nice again. Very nice. So yeah, critical hit damage is double, but... Chance critical hit is 0%. So let's just increase our projectile speed and range. Boosh. All right, so we'll carry on. You can see behind me there is a message in a bottle. So if I can head back to that, that should provide us with a map to like some, some treasure. Oh, I'm going to have to hit that boat. Balls. So we can either go for an unknown, we can go for treasure or a new weapon. I think new weapon is always pretty good. So you can see there's now an arrow in the in the top left. So if we head up towards that way, uh, we should be able to get a new weapon, which should be quite handy because I'm not sure about this weapon. It's, it's not really doing the damage. I mean, it's good when it hits, but it's, it's so good at dodging boats. Like, I guess I need to sort of try and steer so it at least does some hits. I don't know. It's really, really hard to use, uh, which means we're not getting much XP. We're not leveling up too much. So I think the sooner we can get over to wherever we're going, the better. All right, lots of ships now. I'm having to I'm having to dodge quite... Oh, I'm not dodging those. I'm not dodging those. What are they? They're like waving fans at me. Anyway, we have a new upgrade. Let's go for increased armor, increased turning speed, increased projectile spread. Honestly, I'm thinking armor. I probably need armor because I'm not doing the damage. Oh, yes, we've got we've got to the to the treasure site though. So we are raiding a weapons cache, which means we've basically just got to stay in range while that blue bar down the bottom empties. And um, when it does, we'll we'll have a new weapon, which is very nice. Uh, for now though, we've got the ships with the the waving. I don't know what they're waving at me, like fans. They're trying to cool me down. Sword, Jefferson. Take a look. Um, oh, there's also a ship there as well. So if we can take that down, that would be very nice. But again, trying to get this weapon, trying to get that weapon to actually aim in the right place way harder than it looks. How much has the bar got to go? Oh, only a little bit now. Only a little bit. I think we should be okay. I wish my boat was a little bit faster. I wish I did some form of damage as well. Anyway, we finished raiding. We've unlocked the weapons cache. So let's open it up and see what we've got. Oh, we can add to our death stars. Oh, I can have my own saber swingers. Or do I add a harpoon? I feel like a harpoon is probably the sensible thing to go for. Because then that is actually shooting people like all the time. Um, oh, we're going to take some damage here. That's annoying. But right, okay. We should at least do some damage with our harpoons now. And oh, little explosion there. Yeah, there's actually, there's a lot of peanuts in that crowd. Boosh. If I can try and, if I can try and set off a chain reaction, that should help quite a lot. But now though, we've got a new upgrade. So that's just gold. That increases armor. That increases projectile speed and range. So that should be quite good for the harpoon as well. Now, you may notice where you put these does actually have an effect. Can you see like there's a chain between all of these ones? So because both my weapons are linked, it means they all get these upgrades. So basically, I think the, the sort of sensible thing to do with upgrades is to just go like around the outside over to each like where, where the weapon slots are in the corners. I think if you fill up the middle, you're basically just wasting slots. So we'll carry on with what we're doing. Oh no, oh no, we're being surrounded, we're being surrounded. Hopefully there's an out. Yes, there is. But there's also a peanut right next to me. Yes. Oh, we sent it in the middle. That was quite a chain reaction. We leveled up straight away. So that's good. Do I increase my move speed? I think so. A bit of finesse. So that can go in there. We can now go a little bit faster, which hopefully means we can ah, get around these ships. Oh, leveled up again. Increase max health, increase projectile spread or chance to critical hit. I think max health might be the one to go for. I'm feeling a little bit, a little bit weak. Uh, we should start leveling up now, though. 
Um, oh, by the way, there's a big red ship there. So if we can take that down, that's good. We do have another map. I think it's worth going for another weapon. So that would be going north. So let's head up this way. Oh, Ninja Star just oh did the damage. Um, I might increase my move speed again, to be honest. Because if I can if I can just outrun and dodge everyone, we, we're we laughing, basically. Oh, no. Oh, why did I go through this way? Oh, so close to getting hit. That wasn't ideal. Oh, we have, we have destroyed the big ship, though. We've also leveled up. So let's pick something here. Increase damage. I think increased damage is the one to go for. So embark again. I'm just going to go around the island. If I lure them this side and then head up, I should be able to sneak around and go get that treasure chest. Oh no, the whales The whales are out now. There's whales everywhere. Thankfully though, we've made it around. Here is the treasure chest. So what does it contain? I mean, it's a very posh looking chest. It's red and got an, a cross on the top. Ooh, light enemies on fire with each hit. That could be incredible. Captain's hook increase the fire rate for each missing health. Now our health is actually quite high. So I'm going to go with the lantern. I think we'll shove it there because I'm heading to that corner as well. Um, but now we should set enemies on fire, which could be incredible. Right, yeah. So if I can like loop around as my Death Star comes back. Yes. Okay, we got it in the middle. They're all on fire. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> oh, that leveled us up straight away. So in here, increase armor, increase turning speed, increase projectile speed and range. Right, anyway. Oh, no. Explosives. Explosives. Ow. That really hurt. All right, we're down to 250 health. Not ideal. I'm just caning it to try and get the new weapon now. Oh, no, there's more of them. All right, we've got to head around this way. All right, head down here. Oh, boy. Oh, that was close. That was really close. Oh, no, we're, we're taking a hit there. Oh, yeah. Can't escape that. All right, we're down to 185 health. I need some health. There you go. Increase max health. What are the other ones? Oh, projectile bounce. Oh, bounce would be so good. But I feel like if I don't go with health, I'm probably dead. So I'm going to have to go with health, I think. So we'll embark. We've now got 235 health. Um, oh boy, and there's some really fast ships and they're dropping mines everywhere. Um, right, we've made it. We've made it to the next place. So if we can just survive here, then we'll get another weapon. i got to watch out for those explosive barrels and just keep looping around this island. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. There's so many, there's so many people swimming towards me. <laughs> Look at them all. It's not good. All right, thankfully, bar down the bottom is nearly gone. The whales are closing in. Oh, we did it, though. We did it. So pirate port has been raided, which means in this chest, we've got the blunderbuss ambushes. So blunderbuss gunmen and barrels follow the ship in a loose formation. <laughs> is that the only way? Why aren't there any other weapons in there? I don't know, but we'll shove that in the in the back and then we'll embark. I just got to dodge whales a sec. Oh, my goodness. The whales. What are you doing? Okay. Oh, yeah, you can see up the top, there's a little guy. There's a guy in a barrel. How's he moving around so fast? But yeah, he's doing damage to people. There's so many people swimming after me, by the way. That's mental. There's so... Ah, whale. No, the whale. No. Oh, that was so close to dying. All right, I really need to try not to die now. All right, please, max health. Please, max health. Increase armor. Chance to critical hit. Oh, no. As we're so close to dying, I think we take the 500 gold. And then next time we can we can upgrade for a lot more. Hang on, let's just get that. Oh, there's repairs. Okay, so if I can head over to the right where the where the arrows point in, we can repair ourselves. There's blooming whales everywhere, though. It must be like mating season. Right. Oh, no. Oh, that ship was leaving flames behind it. Still, back at our hideout, we now have a load of gold we can spend. So we got 871. So we can increase our turning speed, our move speed, but everything else costs way too much. Uh, so, yeah, may as well buy both of those. So this time we should be a bit more nimble. I'm going to take a different weapon. I've actually unlocked, I unlocked a couple of weapons in that. We've got explosive barrels. As well as the blunderbuss. So, oh, it's just the blunderbuss barrels. Oh, no. So, actually, they're not too bad because there's like, there's quite a few of them dotted about. I'm getting a lot more, a lot more hits on the enemies than I was with the blooming, the ninja stars. Yeah, they're just, they're quite weak. They're not doing that much damage. Okay. Oh, well, at least there's a load of ships. Um, How do I get out? There's a, there's a hole down this way. That's good. We've leveled up. Uh, might actually take the chance to increase critical hits, you know. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. They're they're not the best, but they are way better than the blooming the Death Stars I was using. Sorry, Ninja Stars. All right, leveled up again. What have we got? Increase max health, increase critical hit damage. Ooh, 
Let's go critical hit damage, as I don't need any health at the moment. All right, anyway. Oh, man, we are doing some damage. When the barrels go into the big crowd, that is actually really working for us. Ow. Oh, I just got hit in the ass. Took down 100 of my health. Yeah, so it did only add 5% to the critical damage. So never take that one. Absolutely pointless. Um, let's increase normal damage. I think that's probably a good option. I've now made it to the, the next weapon. I usually go for that one first. I don't know why I went down here. Thankfully, we've got there just in time, which means as we unlock this weapon, where I think out of those, I don't really want to ram ships. Yeah, let's go with the harpoon again. All right, so that is that sorted. Now we're doing way more damage. And I think if we get close to this this big ship we should be able to take it down fairly quickly with our harpoons uh, another upgrade i think this is where we go for the max health right since we lost some health there yeah back up to 650 now all right the treasure chest has been dropped i need to try and not get surrounded though oh, i've leveled up again we're leveling up so fast now i got the harpoons let's increase fire rate again <laughs> we're gonna be shooting fast all right, so treasure chest is down there. I may have to go like the scenic route to it. Or can I can I shortcut to it? I think I can. I think I can. We'll sneak through here. Here we go. Here we go. We got it. We got it. So this time we get increased damage permanently on level up. Or do I do the, the light enemies on fire again? I did quite like the fire, if I'm honest. I'm going to go with the fire. So I'll shove that there and head to that corner. Um, oh, what isn't good is the amount of enemies here. Can I sneak it? Through. Oh, just about, just about. All right, I've got to try and get to the bottom left because that is where the next weapon is. Um, oh boy, oh boy, we're being surrounded, we're being surrounded. I think I can sneak out that way though. We've leveled up again. Critical hit damage, that was so small last time. It's not really worth it. Probably just damage or maybe armor. Let's go damage. I have I did the early sort of finesse stuff, so I can dodge fairly easily. So it probably makes more sense to do a bit of damage. We do now have a couple of swimmers after us. Oh boy. Oh, that was good. Oh, I took a hit. I took a hit. It's my big old butt. I don't know how to like... I'm not used to wielding such a thing. Oh, look. Increased projectile amount. I've got to go for that, right? So if we shove that there. Yeah, look. That goes up by one and two. Also the damage. We are raiding Ramstein shipwreck. Who'd have thought that metal band? They don't travel by tour bus. They travel via... They travel via ship. Oh, no. Oh, no. The whale. The whale. Oh, the whale hit me. I'm trying to stay in range, but there's so many people and whales. We've got it. We've got it. So what's in the box? That always rocks. Oh, rammer. Oh, because it's Ramstein, I guess. Actually, a rammer could help me get out of like tricky situations because I can just ram. Yeah, screw it. I'll take that. And then I should just be able to go like straight through enemies. Yeah, oh, I took damage the first time I used it. <laughs> but yeah, now, now I can literally just go straight through like this whale got completely mullered. Okay, this is actually quite a good build, I reckon. Uh, we'll go with damage. And then, yeah, as long as I can just ram people, like, head on. Boosh, boosh. It works quite well. Boosh. Oh, look, I'm just ramming people. All right, another one down there. Boosh. <laughs> All right, ram those guys. Oh, the ram is actually really good because it just gives you, like, gives you a simple way out. Oh, that wasn't good, though. Explody in the face. All right, what we got here? Increased turning speed or projectile amount. Yes. So we've now got more of the people in the barrels, more of the harpoons going out as well. Oh, this is good. This is actually really good now. All right, halfway to getting this weapon. Things looking pretty good. I'm going to ram that guy. Boosh, boosh, boosh. Oh, can I ram the big ship? Boosh. Oh, I took it down. I got the chest. <laughs> Ooh, these look good. If only one weapon is chained, double its projectiles. Unfortunately, I've linked up everything, so that's pointless. That's the spyglass I could have gone for before. Increased damage by a fraction of the ship's speed. There's also the cross. Double the stat increases of linked upgrades. Oh, it doesn't just mean linked to this. I think it just means linked to this. So I need it in a place where it's surrounded. Okay, so if I'm going to take that, what would be the best thing to do? Probably down here we got damage and rate of fire. So yeah, that's increased damage quite a lot and the projectile mounts as well. Thank you. I think as I add like more upgrades around that, they will get doubled as well. So we'll head out this way. There's whales everywhere. I've upgraded again. Now may be the time to increase my max health. And do I surround that so I get double max health? I think that's probably sensible to be honest. We we'll probably ram a few whales. Boosh. We've killed like all the pirates. Where's all the pirates gone? Oh no, there's a boss. That's why. That one up there. That's the one with the flames behind it. That killed us last time. Anyway, our final weapon is gonna be explosive kegs behind the ship. Oh, that could actually be really good for like when I'm running away from people. 
Oh, do I upgrade my harpoon? I kind of want to know what it does, but I also want an extra weapon. Like, I don't just want it to be a little bit better. Oh, it tells you, fires another harpoon in the opposite direction of the first harpoon. So yeah, that's definitely worth doing then. We'll do that. So yeah, look, now this harpoon's coming out front and back, which means I can hopefully take down this ship. I can ram through those. We are taking down the big ship in quite a big weight because it is not it is not that much faster than me. I'm like staying ahead of it. Oh, I did take damage though. Not ideal. So yeah, harpoons doing the damage. Oh, I just about dodged those. And I think the big ship is down. Nice. So we leveled up. Let's increase our max health. And I think let's do the double one again. Boosh. We'll then embark. Yeah, we got a thousand health now. And oh boy, we need to ram all of those. Boosh. <laughs> I'm so glad I got the rammer. All right, so let's head back to where that arrow is. I don't know what that is, actually. Oh, there's a ship there. But, oh, there's so many people trying to hurt me. Just got to ram everyone that comes straight for me because they get a bit too close. Oh, it's another message in a bottle. Uh, let's do... Let's get another weapon. So I think it's top left. I think the bottom left one is, is a ship, like a big ship. I don't think I'm going to bother trying to thin that herd because they're quite scary, those boats with the little fans poking out. I do like a bit of ram, so I haven't listed them in ages. Oh, what are the what are the bubbly? Oh, there's submarines. We got a ram. Gotta keep trying to escape. All right, the rammer is literally saving my life. Oh, there's so many enemies. That's not fair. Anyway, we're now taking out the big ship. Oh, I took damage. Not ideal. What have we got here? Chance to critical hit or increase armor. I think chance to critical hit is probably a good one. I'm just gonna stick with what I'm doing because it seems to be working. There's so many enemies though. All right, we're back doing damage to it. That's it, that's it. Get in front of it, get in front of it. Oh no, explosives, explosives. Turn around, turn around, turn around. All right, chain reaction. I am faster than the chain reaction, though. All right, where's the fireboat? Oh, it's there. There's more explodey ones. Sod that ship. We'll ignore it for now. We'll try and get to the extra weapon because the extra weapon will actually help me. Oh no, there's so many enemies. <laughs> I took another hit. Yeah, this is no good. This is no good. Where am I going to go? Where am I going to go? Oh no, oh no. There's no way through. Out. All right, let's ram that boat as well. Boosh. We rammed it. We got something good. Oh, we got all the all the gold from the map. Look at all the gold. Okay, that would be good for for next playthrough. In the meantime, got to make it down to this weapon without getting destroyed. I think we have actually passed the worst of it now. Yeah, we're now raiding Cannonback Isle. Oh, we'd be saved somewhat. We've got the increased max health, so let's do the double. So we're up to 790 health again now. That is good. So I've just got to go around this turtle-looking island. Uh, look at all the swimmers chasing after me. <laughs> right, hang on, hang on. If I can just dodge all of these. Yes, we've raided it. We got a new weapon. And what is the weapon? It's Blastoise. I've got Blastoise. A powerful cannonback turtle to help defend the ship. So we should be able to see somewhere a turtle shoot, <laughs> shooting cannons out of its shell to try and get through the explosions. We've got to try and get out of those. Okay, so up this way. Oh, look, there's another ship there. Boosh, get rammed. Proper ramming it. Took him down. All right, there's another one. Oh, eat some of that, you knob. Boosh. Oh, the good thing about this, they get destroyed, and then they get all the gold again. Um, oh, gain 2,000 gold at the end. Move faster when traveling upwards. Oh, increase fire rate for each missing health. Look how much health I'm missing. I think that's the one to go for. So now our fire rate should be absolutely mental. Yeah, it is. Look how fast we're leveling up because we're shooting so quick. Um, then increase fire rate again. Oh, yeah, we're, we're, we're breaking this now. We are starting to break this now. My harpoons. No one can get close to me. Oh, look at the turtle behind me as well. The turtle fire rates are mad. I think this stage of the game, I just want to focus on damage or fire rate. Maybe critical damage. Critical damage was so low, though. I don't think it's worthwhile. Anyway, we are raiding this place. Just got to try and not get hit too much. Oh, I don't know if enemies can actually get that close to me. This will be a test. That will be a test. No, we're looking good. We're actually looking really good. And if I just go straight as well. Yeah, we're laughing. Oh my goodness, what is that? Oh dear, look at this. So I think ah, we've got to take out these little tentacle things first. Oh boy, oh boy. This is absolutely terrifying. I mean, I could try and ram the, the like big thing. But, oh, I survived it. We did it. We actually completed it. Captain's log. We kicked some butt. So if I head back to the hideout now, we got 7,000 coins. Oh, we can start with some really cool stuff. Start with bounce or increase my projectile amount straight up. Oh, and we actually get to start with Blastoise. Maybe we'll have to do that next time. You so totally rock, squirt! But yeah, for now, we survived the Sea of Survivors. Peace, love, and really fast swimming pirates. Bye!